Here is the Beats Pill 2024 model. I'm going to show you how to parent connect these directly to a MacBook or iMac via Bluetooth. First thing is go to your Bluetooth settings on your Apple computer. So from here, I'm just going to go to my click on the Apple logo on the top left hand side. And I'm going to go right down to system settings right there. And then from here, go ahead and tap on Bluetooth. Make sure Bluetooth is toggled on. Okay, now. If you go under nearby devices, you can see that little spinny thing. It's searching for devices that are in pairing mode that's near me. So now we gotta put these in a pairing mode. You get that one power button right here. Uh, these are currently off, okay? Let me just turn these on, press and hold for three seconds. They're on. Now, I'll know it's in pairing mode if the white light here is blinking white rapidly, like white, 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 white. But I'm getting a solid white light, and the reason is because I'm connected, I think, to my and one of my phones, okay? So let me put this in pairing mode, okay? So the power button is here. I'm going to press and hold and wait till it starts blinking white rapidly, okay? So power button here, ready, set, go, press and hold. Keep holding, hold. Now it's blinking white rapidly, all right? Now it's in pairing mode. Now we're going to go back under here, nearby devices, and we're going to scroll down, and I see... Beats pill here, okay? Now, if you took too long with the scan and it's in pairing mode, sometimes you gotta just turn off the Bluetooth and turn it back on and then go back under nearby devices and search for it. Anyway, the Beats pill is right there. So I can go down here, click on connect. Okay, I am now connected and it says connected right there. And then you can click on that little eye right there over here. And this is where you can disconnect or forget this device if you wish. And there you go. So we're connected to this uh, MacBook here. Now, if you had issues uh, connecting or pairing problems, you can always factory reset these. If you need to do that, look in the link below in the description area.